Hi everyone, it's Lori and welcome to my channel. I hope you're all doing well today. So today it is time for our hashtag Thrifty Thursday and this is an open collaboration hosted by Sherry over at Turquoise Streaming. Um, you can jump in and out anytime you want to. If you plan on participating, just go over and let um, Sherry know that you plan on doing that. That way she can add you to her list of collaborators so the other day after uh work i just ran by um uh, a vintage store uh not too far from um yeah where i work and several times a year they have the brazelton antique artisan festival um and their next one is in april so yeah i've never actually been to one but I need to. I'm sure it will be fun. Um, yeah, so there we go. Yeah, we just went by there. So I only have a couple of things that I actually found and picked up. And of course, they were little golden books. Um, so I got this one, and it's uh, The Rabbit's Adventure. Um, this one was $1. The other two, I paid a little more for them than I wanted to, but I absolutely love them so I had to pick them up of course um, and this one is copyright 1977 so yeah I just thought it was really cute this is gonna make a really cute journal um, I need to get on making some little golden book journals uh, I have made a few um, little golden books but they were all the um, Christmas um, and I did them into the uh, December dailies. So yeah, I think I did um, maybe four or five of those. So yeah, this is really cute. It has some really cute images in here. But yeah, I'm thinking this little cute bunny will make a really cute journal. And I have saw people... Um, actually make journals several different ways out of the uh, little golden books still has a little thing in the back I guess for you to order yeah 14 day free trial of little golden books so that is that one it's in pretty good shape got a little bit of um, wear here but yeah, we could fix that where there was something else down the spine anyway, so that's really not going to matter. So we picked up that one. And the other one that I picked up was this um, Prayers for Children. I have never personally saw one of these. Look at that. It is um, does have a person's name there. But look at how I love the way these pages are. Um, this one is copyright 1952. And I'm thinking this was in the back, maybe. Oh, no, it had a little tag in it. Um, I did pay $5 for this one. Um, and I don't know if these pages were made like this or what, but they look, you know, patina to me. Um, but, yeah, I have never saw one of those. Look at the illustrations in there, how pretty. So cute. Absolutely love this little golden book. Father, we thank thee. The Lord's Prayer. No writing except for the inscription of the name. Such a cute little golden book. Bedtime prayer. Good night prayer. God watches us. Good night. Look at how cute that is. Oh, I am so at evening prayer. Yep. Oh, and this one, it doesn't have a skew on it. I didn't even notice that when I picked it up. And then this one also does not have a skew. Um, which that one didn't have one either, so. And it was 77. 
But this one is Sleeping Beauty. Oh, this was the same person. They just didn't do the last name. It's a little bit here, and the spine's a bit compromised there. Um, I think this one was $2, if I'm not mistaken. And, oh yeah, that page is torn there. And this is 1958. Yeah. You can still pretty much see it all. Super cute. A little bit of damage there. A little bit here. But yeah, this would still make a super, super cute journal. I absolutely love this book as well. Again, some damage here. And then I think that's crayon. We may be able to get that off. Yeah. So that is it this week, guys, for my Thrifty Thursday. Uh, and again, this was from a little um, antique shop not far from where I work. And I also wanted to share one more thing with you guys. So, um, I had told you guys a week or so ago that my daughter Veronica, her birthday is March the 13th. And her and a friend had actually went to Savannah. And she brought me back a bag of um, Savannah saltwater taffy. So, yeah, that's going to be yummy. Expensive, man. But, yeah, saltwater taffy. And then she brought me back, um, she called them postcards, but I don't think they're actually postcards. They're art prints of Savannah. Look at how pretty that is, guys. And this is a white fill square in Savannah. And then this is what it looks like on the back. So this will be going in my journal. The charm and romance and beauty of the square hosts many weddings and outdoor events. It was named for Reverend George Whitefield, who founded the Bestetha, Bethan, uh, yeah, I can't say that, orphanage in 1740. Yeah, well, wow, so pretty. And then this one, this is Forsyth, Forsyth Park. Look at how pretty that is. So pretty. Love these. Um, during Azalean time, Savannah is transformed into a sea of color of thousands upon thousands of plants burst into full bloom. Uh, this scene shows the Forsyth Park fountain which was modeled after the one in uh, Place de la Concorde, Paris, France. Oh, wow. Look how pretty that is. Might have to take a trip down there when those azaleas are in bloom. Alright, guys. Thank you all so much for joining me today. I really do appreciate it. Again, this is hashtag Thrifty Thursday. It is hosted by Sherry over at Turquoise Dreaming. Um, if you would like to participate, just post your videos on Thursday. Use the hashtag, hashtag Thrifty Thursday. Um, also, make sure to link, um, put a link in your description box to your video to Sherry's YouTube channel. Um, she will do the same for you. Just let her know that you plan on participating. Thank you guys so much for joining me. Thank you all for your support. And we shall see you next time. Bye-bye.